Hey guys, this is All Things Cupcake 2000, and today I'm doing a, um, sorry, a charm update, and this is charm update 15, so, um, I might be having a YouTube shop, and, um, I probably will because I'm still figuring out the prices, though, so, yeah, and sorry if you hear a little sniffle and my voice is kind of weird right now, but anyways, um, yeah, let's get started, um, so, the first charms I have are these two Mickey Mouse steaks and like they're textured and everything so yeah one's a little bit bigger so you can see a tutorial on that on um, a collab channel that I'm on and it's called Worldwide Crafters and then I made two mustache pizzas inspired by um, Loves the Clay and they look like this and except hers I think had chef hats on them so the mustaches are textured and the pizza crust is shaded and then I made this um, Hello Kitty cookie and I really 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 love this so yeah it's textured in uh, kind of ironically, I forgot to shade it, and I'm usually a super duper big sucker for shading. And, but it's textured though, so I really, really love that. <clears throat> and then I made this little cake, and it's just a really simple square cake. And it's textured, and then the top has um, this pink icing and then it has orange cane and this other cane, this little like star cane, oops, there's a little hair, and then it has multicolored translucent micro marbles. Um, then I made these two oranges and they look like this and I have one of my own so I just made more because I thought they were really cute. And then I made this little mold, and this is like um, a super mold, ma, um, amazing mold putty. That's what it is. I was going to say super mold putty, but anyways, I don't know whose original idea this is because I've seen it circulate through YouTube so many times. So that one has clay eyes, and then I made this other fat mamagoma about to eat a donut, and it just looks like that. And then it, it's like the same ones I made. Um, I made this golden cupcake trophy, like, for first place, and it has a clay face. And then I made, um, let me get it to this gloomy bear pig, and this is my original idea, so I would appreciate if you gave me credit, because I would really appreciate it. <clears throat> so, it's, um, gloomy bear, except in pig style, so... He has like vampire teeth and then it has like little blood splats <laughs> and it looks like that. And actually how I got that idea is I was doodling on my math book when I was supposed to be doing math and I doodled a pig and then I added vampire teeth and then it looked like gloomy bear so yeah. Anyways, um, the next thing I made are these um, chibi styled robots I guess flat back chibi styled robots so the first one I made is this um, robot gone bad one and it looks like this and the reason why it's gone bad is because half of its heart went black and yeah so it looks like that and then I made another one and this one has its tongue sticking out like that and then it also has a half black heart and then I made these other two and this is like um they're happy ones and then this could either be I was these were supposed to be like sleepy faces but I, I think they kind of look like them so they have blue hearts and then I made this um just I was making this while I was watching TV so I wasn't paying attention or anything so it's kind of um weird anyway so um it's this rainbow cake and it's super duper textured like that 
and it has blue, purple, pink, and green and orange. And then with the leftover clay head from the slice, I made these like sprinkles for the top, and it's like I didn't add enough tila, so it's like pokey. And then um, I'm going to show you my Pokeballs. So I'm not really into Pokemon, but I just made them because I saw them from Sony and I thought they were super cool. So I made this one and this is the abnormal one. I just had scrap clay so I just made it. So this is red, green, and orange and they go together like this and they could be couple charms or best friend charms. And then I made, let me see if these ones fit together. Nope. Okay, wait. I'm trying to fit them together. These Pokeball ones, and they look like this. And these are pretty hard to make. So, yeah, that's why they look kind of weird. But they go together. And this one's a regular. And then I made this one as well. So I made three of those. And then I made another one, but I didn't really, I didn't really like it. So I just don't want to show it. And then I made this, um, actually I didn't make this, my friend made this, um, she made, she came over to my house yesterday, so, um, I taught her how to make a bow, and then she wanted to make a bow ring, so I let her, and hers has just a plain, really pretty crystal kind of gem on it, and then she as well made this little apple bow, and this is really cute, and then my favorite thing that she made is this little mini cat head. And I think it's absolutely adorable. Um, then I made this bow ring. And this is like a sea green with peach, peach polka dots. And this is a junior size, I guess, because it fits me. And then I made this one. This is, I'm going to do custom colors for this. So you're going to get to, um, like pick out your polka dots if you buy it. And then I have one of the simplest but prettiest and one of my favorite charms I've ever made. And it's really, really simple is this little ladybug on a leaf. And I don't know where I got inspired from, but it's like a really tiny ladybug and I love it so much. And it has eyes and it won't focus because it did indents on it. And then like the leaf is a little bit curled. Then I made this Relicuma Donut, and I have another one that looks better, but this is like my favorite color combination, I guess. And then I did the same with the Pokeballs. I did the same thing with a cookie I made, and this is half a chocolate chip cookie, and my other friend has the other half. And then um, I made this cake, and this was inspired by Uh Oh. 309 or something I don't know photography I have no clue what the numbers are but yeah so she did um, a Hunger Games cake um, she did Annie's and Phoenix Hunger Games cake so I just was inspired by the cake making and this is just scrap clay so mine has the combination of this teal color this purple and yellow and it just looks like that and it has a bow and then this one lost a lot of candles but I have them and I'm gonna glue them on <clears throat> and it is the sea cake and it has little octopus and then it has waves and then it has that little plant and then it has starfish and another little plant <clears throat> so yeah this is all things cupcake 2000 and i hope you enjoyed this charm update bye guys